Robert does not like to spend a lot of time on research and check his stocks every day and fears the huge ups and downs. Robert knows that bonds do not deliver net performance after inflation. Robert knows that many funds managers do not deliver performance and charge big for their bonuses. Hello, Robert. I am the money fairy and will fulfill all your wishes regarding an investment. Robert starts with a wish list for his money. Robert wants a management approach based on scientific research, have the possibility to gain in rising and falling markets. He wants short-term availability of his funds. He only wants to pay on delivered performance. He wants regular reporting, a government-regulated environment. Managed futures offer a government-regulated way to get money managed by a third party. It is possible to manage the money in segregated accounts on the name of the owner or a pool. Managed futures can gain in rising and falling markets and can reduce overall portfolio volatility. Most managed futures programs are based on scientific research and have proven track records. Managed futures did not have bigger drawdowns during critical events. Historically, managed futures tend to grow more linear than stocks or other assets classes. Managed futures have the benefit that they can be long, short, or flat in the market. This means that they can profit in rising markets and falling markets. Most managed futures are diversified. For example, they trade gold, oil, stock indexes, silver, gasoline, copper. Diversification can bring the benefit that all money is not in only one market. If something negative happens in one market, it only affects a part of the portfolio. Managed futures are based on scientific approaches. This can be, for example, a so-called spread or a trading strategy. The chart shows the price of the commodities on the left side, the ordinate, and the times of the year on the abscissa. Heating oil has a seasonal pattern. It has the highest price at the beginning of the winter season at September when people start to heat. Heating oil is highly correlated to the crude oil market. If we only would buy heating oil in September, we could lose money if the oil market goes down. Heating oil and gasoline are oil cracks. Gasoline has a seasonal pattern too. It has the highest price in summer when driving increases and the lower prices in winter. If we buy heating oil in September and sell gasoline at the same time, we get a market neutral position against the moves in the oil market. This is because we are long and short the same number of positions and only take profit from the spread of the two contracts. If, for example, the oil market falls and heating oil and gasoline falls the same amount, we will not lose money because we are a market neutral. If heating oil prices rise and gasoline prices fall, we will profit from the spread. Do not worry if you do not understand because this was a professional scientific trading approach. Now I will show you a second approach. The second strategy is called generic regression, a scientific trend following strategy based on regression. In a regression analysis, data is modeled using least squares predictor approach and means that a line is plotted as close as possible to the closing prices. The slope and angle of the regression line gives an indication about the strength and the direction of the trend. The picture shows an uptrend with an angle of approximately 50 degrees. The regression line is linear, projected into the future and used to estimate the next closing prices. If an uptrend is discovered from the regression angle by the strategy, the strategy will wait till there is a little down move in the uptrend. This chart shows the historic performance of a strategy over the last 10 years. You can see an approximate linear buildup over the last 1800 trades. The chart shows the profit and loss distribution of one strategy with losses ranging up to $4,500 and winners up to $20,000. The logic of the strategy is that it is predefined how much loss the strategy will take and after how much profit the strategy will step out. These rules are based on historic scientific findings. All these strategies get traded together in a portfolio on different commodities. The portfolio is split in different commodities to avoid big losses and to spread the investment as broad as possible. The chart shows the current split. Note that the split can change. Accounts get professionally managed by a PhD team. Trading strategies are proven by scientific historic backtesting. Management fees are based on performance. Managed futures risk disclosure statement. The risk of loss in trading commodities can be substantial. You should therefore carefully consider whether such trading is suitable for you in light of your financial condition. The high degree of leverage that is often obtainable in commodity trading can work against you as well as for you. Past performance is not necessarily indicative of future returns. The value of investment may go down as well as...